if your videos are boring, it's probably because you're making these five common mistakes. But the good thing is, after watching this video, you will not only learn how to avoid these mistakes, but also learn how to make your video super engaging and get more views. Here's how. By 3 p.m.? Yeah, I can do it. Mistake number one is revealing too much too soon to your audience. If you reveal too much too soon, you will fail to do what's probably the most important thing in your video, which is raising questions in the mind of the viewer. The reason why your video should raise questions is that it keeps the viewer watching until they get the answer to that question. Here's an example. By 3 p.m.? Yeah, I can do it. I can get the video done by 3 p.m. Instead of revealing that the character promises to get a video edited by 3 p.m., I cut the shot immediately after the character said, By 3 p.m.? Yeah, I can do it. The next mistake is starting the video with a wide establishing shot. Now, I'm not saying that you should never do it, but in this situation, I deliberately started the sequence with a close-up shot of the character speaking on the phone. The reason this makes the video interesting is that you can't see the environment of the scene, and the lack of information makes the viewer more curious, and it makes the viewer want to continue watching to find out more. Next mistake, choosing the wrong song. The music choice for the video or scene should always support the emotion that you want to convey. I'll show you an example. How would have you felt if I would have used this song in the cinematic video in the intro? <laughs> Exactly. You would have probably felt very confused and the video would have ended being very boring because the song just didn't support the story. Now you might be wondering how on earth is Yussi able to use all of this mainstream music on his YouTube video legally? Well, that's because every single song in this video is licensed from Licked. Licked is the music platform that allows creators to use mainstream music from the world's biggest artists and stock music without losing any ad revenue or getting copyright claims. So, whether you are a YouTuber with millions of subscribers or an aspiring creator, Licked allows you to license over 1 million mainstream tracks to choose from artists like Justin Bieber, Bruno Mars, or David Guetta. The benefit of using mainstream music from Licked in your video is that viewers will be watching longer and engage with your video more. Also, they've made finding music extremely easy with these simple search filters such as Spotify popularity, mood, genre, and so on. Sign up to Link from my link for 14 days of free stock music and 50% off your first mainstream chart track. Thank you Link for sponsoring this video. Next mistake is having way too many shots in one scene. And that's because every frame that the viewer sees should provide some kind of new information that moves the story forward. 
For example, what I did in the beginning of the cinematic video was, instead of showing the character picking up the phone, then saying hello, and then saying what he actually wanted to say, I instead cut all of that out and I went straight to the point with the character saying, by 3 p.m.? Yeah, I can do it. Next mistake is not having a compelling hook in the beginning of your video. Depending on how good or how bad your hook is, that will determine whether or not your viewer will actually watch the video. For example, I could have edited that cinematic video like this. As you can see, there was something missing in the cinematic video. By 3 p.m.? Yeah, I can do it. The reason the hook works is that it raises questions in the viewer's mind about what did the main character actually promise to do by 3 p.m. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more, then I highly recommend watching this video over here. Alright, thanks for watching and I'll see you again in the next video. Take care.